Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne and today's video is going to be a cleaning marathon. I have taken some of my recent cleaning videos and put them into one long video for hours of cleaning motivation. Thank you so much for being here today and if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like and hit that subscribe button for more cleaning. Hey everyone, welcome back to another cleaning video. Today we have a ton of cleaning that we need to get done. My house was pretty messy as most of you know. I did just have a baby girl a few weeks ago when I filmed this video. She was right around two weeks old. Elvis was getting ready to go back to work so we knew we needed to get the house picked up. So I hope you guys enjoy today's video and if you enjoy longer videos, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. But let's go ahead and just get right into to it. All right, so first we are starting out in the kitchen. I knew that the kitchen and living area was going to take me the most time. I had been trying to keep up with my bedroom, but I had let these areas completely go for the last few weeks. Elvis and the kids had been doing um, a good job of just keeping it picked up, but I definitely have a lot of areas that I actually need to get cleaned. But I did not do all this cleaning in one day. I did it over the period of two days and I took lots of breaks and I even went into the evening time just whenever the baby was sleeping I was getting my cleaning done but once I did finish with the kitchen and living area y'all I was so surprised that it happened all so fast because when I was pregnant I was the slowest cleaner like in the world it would take me forever just to clean the kitchen and the living area but I think just to clean these areas it probably took me about an hour and a half to two hours whereas when I was pregnant it probably would have taken me at least three hours to finish we could run away across the ocean Baby, what you say? We can leave today Anywhere we'll go, we'll be alright It's all about you It's all about you It's all about you So we got the kitchen picked up now we're gonna get started on these dirty dishes which of course I have a lot of dirty dishes that I need to get done I had been trying to kind of keep up on them but y'all know sometimes it just gets out of hand and you get behind on things and we just got to get it done and I do have three other kids so I am a mom of four and in our household um, I would love to just take off and rest and you know with all the postpartum things but I really have to keep up on my house or one it's going to be an issue with like my postpartum um, like recovery because I have had some anxiety and um, some depression in the past and I just feel like keeping up on my house really helps me not um, fall into that so I was feeling good this day and I was ready to get up and start doing some things and Elvis has been a huge help while he was off he was actually outside cleaning and doing like the windows and things like that you guys will see him in a little bit uh, further into the video and he's also been helping me with laundry and I would much rather do cleaning than keep up with the laundry so I was really appreciative of all his help The sink was in desperate need of a really good clean, so I am going to use the soft scrub with bleach. I'm going to scrub it, let it sit for a while. We're gonna go and clean some other areas. We're gonna clean the stainless steel appliances, and then we're gonna come back and clean the sink out.
I'm using the Wayman Stainless Steel Cleaner to clean the appliances. Dear returning viewer, thank you so much for being here today. I have missed you guys, so make sure to say hi in the comments. And I just want to say thank you to everybody for all the sweet messages that you have left on my community post and in my first story video. And if you're new, welcome. I'm Julianne. I'm a stay-at-home mom of four. I have three girls and a one little boy, all ranging through the ages of nine all the way to newborn. I make a ton of cleaning content on my channel. I also love to to do some holiday decor inspiration and just typical um, decor inspiration so if you guys enjoy that type of content make sure to hit that subscribe button and say hi in the comments Now we're coming back to the sink. We're gonna just rinse it out. It looks so much better. I'm telling you, if y'all have a white sink, the Sub Scrub with bleach is the best product that I have found that gets rid of all the stains in my sink. It just works really, really well. Maybe I'm just too weak. Maybe I'm just afraid of being alone. Well, I don't care, cause right now I feel the love that we said we would burn. I know that you feel it too I know that I told you To clean the countertops, I am using the Blue Land all-purpose cleaner. So this is 27 It doesn't matter what I've been through I should go out 
missed my fall clean and decorate i'll make sure to link that video in the description box below that way you guys can check it out i am going to be changing things up a little bit today and then i need to make my way to the store at some point because i do have a few more things that i would like to add to the kitchen um, you guys had given me some great suggestions about what I could do differently and the vase that I'm going to be putting on the kitchen table. You guys will see that in a few minutes. So I do want to run to Hobby Lobby and um, get some new florals to put in there. And then I also want to add something onto the kitchen island. All right, so we got the kitchen nice and cleaned up. There's Elvis wiping down the windows. Now I'm going to be lighting one of my favorite candles. I picked this one up from Kirkland's. It's the pumpkin gingerbread and y'all it smells so good. So this is 27. Start the music, kill the silence. Let my mind so as much as I love the table setup, I think that it is beautiful. I had some plates out here, I decided to put those away, but also just too much decor, y'all. It just stresses me out. So I needed to get this off. I need to get my table wiped down, get it cleaned up. And I am looking rough in this video. As I'm watching it back, I look so tired and uh, yeah, y'all are just here to see me clean. I know none of you guys care, but obviously after you have a baby, you're a little bit self-conscious about your appearance and watching this back, I am just feeling definitely self-conscious. <laughs> Now we're moving into the living room and I'm not gonna lie y'all, I have been letting Camila keep her toys out here. They keep her entertained. She is one of my kids who constantly just plays by herself, is really, really good about that. And she'll sit at her little table and draw and color. Um, so your house does not need to be perfect. If you have kids, leave the toys out. You don't need to put them all away. The majority of people who are coming into your house, they don't care about the toys. Be someone you love and it gets me dumb um, Yeah, I had you where I wanted you Had you by my side it was all I ever needed But couldn't realize I don't know how it feels to Be someone you love and it gets me dumb I let it slip somehow This rug is so dirty. I need to get out my carpet shampooer. I need to get it cleaned. It is just really gross right now, but it also just has stains on it. It's super old and I am gonna be getting a new one. I've been looking online and I think I found the one that I do want to get. We have had this one for a really long time and I love the way it looks. So I will definitely be getting something that is very similar. Like an overdose, you're the antidote Losing sleep, I'm in too deep No matter where I hide, you got me sleep deprived You're the 
I'm going to quickly vacuum and mop. I have not mopped my floors in I don't even know how long. They were pretty disgusting. So we are gonna get that done. Then I'm gonna be taking a little bit of a break because I need to get the baby out, take care of her. We're gonna go grab some lunch and then I'll be back later in the evening while the girls are taking a little bit of a nap. I am using Fabuloso to mop. All right, so now I'm gonna be getting Sophia out and y'all, she has been loving the swing. I did have um, my other two kids who did not like the swing at all. They preferred a bouncer, but I am so happy that my mom got the swing for me because it has been a lifesaver.
I don't know about you guys, but seeing tiny little babies stretch is just one of the cutest things and their little tiny feet and toes are just so adorable. We grabbed some lunch at a local place here where we live at and then we stopped over by this place called The Coffee Shop and y'all, they have the best scones. They're really, really good. The girls were so tired by the time that we got back. They are taking a nap, so I am going to get the bedroom picked up, which isn't terrible, but here I have some diapers that I need to get thrown away, some other trash, and then just really have some things that I need to pick up and get some things wiped down. But who are we kidding, kidding? We can't pretend that we feel nothing And keep it hidden now Cause I've been thinking about crossing the line And just giving, can I feel it the way I do? Uh-huh Cause I've been thinking about you all the time Thinking it out So we do live in Arizona and everything gets just so dusty here. If you do not dust every week, I mean, my room just gets gross. I had piled some stuff up in this chair. I wanted to get it cleaned out because I did want to be able to feed the baby and rock her here. I picked up this organizer from Amazon and it has been one of my favorite things to have. I just put the baby's diapers in here, some wipes and um, some extra clothes. It has been great having at nighttime.
I had taken my duvet off the bed, so I am going to get that thrown in the washer, and then I'm going to be removing the sheets once Camila wakes up. Me was all you tried when you were around. I've been told too many times now. Yeah, loving me was all you tried when you were around. I've been told to make the girls were starting to wake up so I decided I was going to quickly vacuum and honestly Sophia loves the sound of the vacuum. Whenever she is upset I will just get the vacuum out and start vacuuming while I'm holding her and she loves it. I do have an extra white sheet. I am going to be getting that put on. As you guys can see, it's super wrinkly, so I am going to be using this downy wrinkle release. Now that we're finished with the bedroom, we are going to be coming into the bathroom, which as you guys can see, it's a complete mess. We have a lot of work we need to get done in here.
Drown yourself in the neon You came to this place to hide away in the dark You tell yourself you need to move on But when not in the shadows can ease your broken heart I really need to get the bathtub cleaned out and I also need to get the shower clean. I am going to be using this bleach gel and then I picked up um, one of those scrubbers from Target that has the long hand. I know I'm late to the game on this one, but I love it. If you guys don't have one, I highly suggest getting one. To clean the glass, I am using the Dawn Power Wash, and then again, I'm going to be using that gel bleach cleaner. This way, but it's not that easy. You're complicating things for me. No, it's not that easy. Maybe just a little time can heal me, but it doesn't feel the way. What are you doing to me? Why'd you break my heart? Owen's room isn't terrible. I am just going to get it picked up and wipe it down. I just want to get it looking nice in here. I hope you'll come back to me. Yeah, I'm just that stupid. Thought that we were meant to be. Yeah, I'm just that stupid. Maybe just a little time can make you change your mind about us. I thought that we 
we were meant to be So the last place we're going to be cleaning is the kids bathroom today. I am just going to quickly get it wiped down and get it cleaned. Get the Russian, heaven on the Just love. You should know. 
Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne and today's video is going to be packed with tons of cleaning motivation. First, we are gonna be starting out in the laundry. Here, I'm just using the spray and wash on the girls' clothes. They did have a few stains and I find that this works really well with the OxyClean paired with it. Camila had been helping me pick up her toys, but then she ran to the grocery store with Elvis, so I'm going to finish picking everything up. Um, if you guys hear Sophia, she is here hanging out with me right now while I'm doing this voiceover. If you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for being here today. I appreciate all of your guys' love and support and that you guys take time out of your day to come and clean with me. And if you're new, welcome. I'm Julianne. I'm a stay-at-home mom of four. I just recently had my fourth baby. She just turned a month old. On my channel, you will find tons of cleaning motivation. I also like to do some decor inspiration. So if you enjoy that type of content, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Broken heart, no matter what you think, you'll never ever get enough of love. Let me know in the comments what you guys are up to today and if you are being affected by the hurricane that is going on right now. I just want to let you know that I'm sending lots of love and prayers your way. Seem to have the time, but when it's hard, you just grow cold up. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. The words you be, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires, fires around ourselves. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. The words you be, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires, fires around ourselves. It's deja vu. My floors are pretty gross and in need of a really good vacuum so I'm going to be taking an extra long time while I'm vacuuming here getting it all nice and clean. We are going to get this rug clean today. I actually just got my new one in the mail, so I'm going to be putting that out soon. And I actually got a new TV stand too. While I was in the process of getting all the shampoo stuff together, I knocked over an entire big gulp soda. So I am going to get that picked up or cleaned up super fast. Should be good, but we'll keep 
And once we actually come in to clean the kitchen, then I'll wipe everything down and mop in here. Would you be good for skin the salads? We should be good, but we'll keep out of fire. We keep on talking and talking, talking and talking. Honestly, this rug probably could have used a second or third shampooing, but I decided since the new one was in the mail and coming, I wasn't going to waste my time since time is super limited when you are trying to get all your cleaning done in one day. You tell yourself you need to move on, but when not in the shadows can ease your broken while I was doing my fall clean and decorate, I had asked you guys for suggestions about the vase. I didn't love the floral arrangement that I have in here right now. Somebody had suggested taking out the pumpkins and I actually did that just the other day and I feel like it does look better. And somebody had also mentioned about adding just a few more like, um, I can't remember exactly what they called them, but they're like little floral things that you just grab from Hobby Lobby. And I think I'm gonna try to get those. Honestly, I just haven't been <laughs> to the store to do like actual shopping in quite some time. I've been doing everything online. So now we're gonna get started on the dirty dishes and I don't know if it's just me, but I take a couple hours out of Saturday and Sunday typically to clean my house and then I keep up on it for like three days and by the time Thursday and Friday hits, y'all, my house is just a complete disaster. I feel like I, maybe I'm just like burnt out and done for the day and then I just know that Saturday when Elvis is home, I'm just gonna get everything done and maybe that's why it happens but now my kids are on fall break for two weeks and i'm just looking around y'all and it is just a complete mess right now is like a roller coaster but i'm trying to hold on i don't want it to stop even though we fight sometimes and it feels like a war zone i still care about us how do you move on when everything goes wrong i'm trying to find a way to get you out of my head don't know how to cope with being so broken Girl, I can't forget about what we said I just want to love you a little bit more Don't just walk away from me and close the door Baby, pull me closer now before it's over I just want to love you a little bit more Oh, I know that 
it's difficult dealing with emotions but i want you to know that you'll always be on my mind even in the hard times i care about you how do you move on when everything here i'm using the soft scrub with bleach to clean the sink Just wanna love you a little bit more. Don't just walk away from me and close the door. Baby, pull me closer now before it's over. I just wanna love you a little bit more. Oh, love you a little bit more. Love you a little bit more. Love you a little bit more. I am going to get the soda mess cleaned up over here and then we are going to be mopping the floors. going to vacuum and mop and you guys can see Sophia back there she had um, been out with Alba's and then she was pretty tired when she got back home so she is taking a nap and she loves the sound of the vacuum whenever I bring um, my new babies home I always vacuum and I don't make my kids be quiet or anything like that because y'all this house is never going to be quiet and I want to get the baby used to that Feeling something for 
So I did end up taking a little break. Sophia ended up waking up. So we were just gonna hang out until Elvis got home with the other kids. He was actually picking up a Sam's Club order. And whenever I am doing these cleaning videos, y'all, I take tons and tons of breaks because it does just take a lot of time. So Elvis did get our Sam's Club pickup order. Right now, y'all, we are in survival mode. I did have a ton of chicken and frozen vegetables and other things in the freezer and refrigerator. And I also picked up some things from Target that I'm going to be getting organized for the pantry. No regrets and windows down, 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 down. Owen was trying to decide what snack he wanted, but he decided to get something else. Then I have the kitchen and living area cleaned and I have the snacks organized. We are gonna be heading into the bathroom. I am just using the Blue Land bathroom cleaner. All my thoughts are running. Running around inside my head Emotions keep coming They're keeping me from thinking straight Thought it would be different When I got my things in place Stuck in this commotion How come I pass this yet? I wanted me to be somebody else Another me that doesn't need your help But if I'm honest I don't think we got it 
Try to change the things you never like. Try to make this better, make this right, but we're the same. Even though I changed, really made an effort, promised I would change, but something stayed the same. Wanted to do better, wanted to be great, but something stayed the same. To clean the shower, I am using the Clorox bleach gel. I learned it all and I'll adapt, even if I changed up everything except my name. We will still be fighting, cause I am still the same. I wanted me to be somebody else, another me that doesn't need your help. But if I'm honest, I don't think we got it. I try to change the things you never like. Try to make this better, make this right, but we're the same. Even though I changed, really made an effort, promised I would change, but something stayed the same. Wanted to do better, wanted to be great, but something stayed the same. Something stayed. The bedroom isn't terrible. I did recently change the sheets and then I took off my duvet cover just because it seems like every other day I'm having to take it off, wash it, put it back on, and y'all, it is just a pain. So I think I'm just gonna keep it off for right now. While we're in this season of life, um, the baby is spitting up, then I have to change it. Camila, for some reason, brought her pancakes in here the other day, got syrup on it. Um, so it is just a pain to put it back on. So we're just gonna keep it off. Won't you lean on me? I'll catch you if you fall. So take a leap of faith. Your fixed idea is clouding up your mind. Won't we'll stop until common sense applies. The sun illuminates ahead. Need you to let go. Here I'm going to use a Clorox wipe just to quickly wipe down the tables. Like I said, it's not bad in here. I just had a few things I wanted to do.
How do I get this low? You come over and we start a fight Never know who's wrong or right Feel nothing when you go I know it's not intelligent Drinking for the hell of it But there's nothing I can do about it Why do I fall back to you? It's like you're a drug to me I can't quit It's not like we're still 22 Trying something new Just a pastime I don't think that we ever could work this out now. It was a Thursday night when I first saw you Those green eyes caught me Yeah, it was crazy It was a Friday night when I first kissed you You struck me like lightning You broke my chains and released me And days turn into nights on the couch in your apartment No, I am not Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne and today's video is going to be a whole house clean with me. I have a ton of cleaning that I'm going to be getting done in this video. We are going to be getting every room and it is pretty messy. First we are going to be starting out over here in the dining area. We're going to get everything picked up. We're going to get everything wiped down and the house is going to be looking really good when we finish. If you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for being here today. I appreciate you guys coming and hanging out with me every Saturday morning, getting our cleaning done together. And if you're new, welcome. I'm Julianne. I'm a stay-at-home mom of four. I recently just had my fourth baby. I have three girls and one little boy, all ranging from the ages of nine down to newborn, which I'm so sad, but Sophia is about ready to be out of the newborn stage. So y'all know that with four kids, you're going to get all the real messes with realistic cleaning motivation. I also like to do some decor inspiration. So if you guys enjoy that type of content, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys enjoy longer videos, make sure to give this video a like and I'll make sure to get some longer videos out on Saturday so we can all get our Saturday cleaning done together. For the first half of this video, Sophia will be in the carrier. She loves this baby carrier, or I guess it's not a carrier, it's a wrap. I think it's one of the Soli wraps. I had just ordered it off of Amazon, but if you guys saw in the beginning, she does not like to have her head tucked in when um, she is awake, and it stresses me out because, you know, she still just wobbles her head around a lot, so I feel like I'm constantly holding on to it, but here she fell asleep and she was looking really comfortable. I was able to tuck her little head in. So if you are a mom and you have a little one, I definitely recommend this. When they get older, I do prefer to have like an actual carrier just because it's a little bit easier on your back. But we're gonna get these dishes done and then y'all, we just have so much that we have to get done. I feel like that sometimes the week it just gets away and by you know the end of the week y'all i'm just <laughs> i'm done it's been four weeks since you called and i've been waiting here for you all along i've been waiting here for you all along where you been where did you go i wonder if you found what you're looking for Wonder if you found what you're looking for. All right, so we got the dishwasher filled. Now I'm going to start on a few things that I'm going to be washing by hand. But while I was editing this bag, I was like just looking at Sophia's tiny little feet. And why is everything about babies just so sweet? Like their little feet and their little hands, y'all. I just can't. I honestly didn't think that we were gonna have a fourth baby. It definitely wasn't in the plans for us, but I have to say that since she has been here, she has been such a wonderful addition to our family and the children love her so much too. Say that you It's been so cold without you here. We barely. 
barely say goodbye before you disappear. It's been so cold without you. Once we get a little bit further into this video, I do have a few Amazon finds that I'm excited to share with you guys that I found for the girls' rooms. It's just for bows and scrunchies, but I am going to be doing a little bit of organizing and decluttering in Camila and Victoria's room. The sink was really dirty today, so I am using the soft scrub with bleach, and I'm just using the sponge that I picked up from Ikea. I think I got a six pack for like maybe $2. It was a while back when I bought them. I do prefer the scrub daddy, but I also wanted to use these up because I just had them sitting underneath my sink. Here I'm going to be using the Blue Land Cleaner to clean the countertops. This is one of my new favorite all-purpose cleaners. Let me know in the comments if your kids have been sick since they went back to school. I think that we have passed around a cold in our house for the last month. It's like one kid gets over it, another kid gets it, and then so on. And y'all, Sophia got sick. I had kept her, you know, healthy and good for about three weeks while the kids was passing it around, and then she got it. And you guys will see at the like end of this video when I'm doing my room, I had so much laundry that I needed to do because she was constantly spitting up from where she was just so congested. But luckily she is doing so much better now. We're gonna be making a cup of coffee. Owen really wanted to be in my video. He was excited. So he was gonna help me make my coffee and you guys will see um, he's gonna be putting some cinnamon and sugar on this. But I grabbed this coffee mug from Target. I thought it was really cute and I wanted to share it with you guys. I'm using the Wayman stainless steel cleaner to clean the appliances. To the good days, is to the sorrows. If this is a mistake, I know about tomorrow. I don't want to fight no more, because I don't feel the need no more. No. For the stove top, I am using that Wayman's um, stainless steel cleaner again, but I'm also going to be using some Dawn Power Wash on this wet microfiber cloth towel. Good 
and run Don't say we didn't I was your first love And you were my first one Cheers to all the memories The venom and the remedies, yeah Promise I won't forget now we're moving into the living area. It's not terrible in here, but I do have some work I'm gonna be getting done. I am gonna be taking the couch apart. Um, actually, Elvis is gonna be helping me get it cleaned up because it was pretty bad and we had to take the tops off of the cushion. I'm gonna be putting them in the washer. Now that I have the girls' closet cleaned out, I feel like I wanna try to put the Barbie house back in there. Um, if you guys have been here for my last few videos, I've been leaving it out because Camila likes to play with it. But I think I am going to try to put it back in there with my next video because I am gonna be doing like a living room refresh. Wish you the best and say goodbye You start to get dressed and then we cry Cause we both know it's gonna hurt But not as much as this does So baby, bye It's for the best and you know why You gotta leave me here right now Before we make this even worse It's gonna hurt Now that we're finished vacuuming, we are going to mop. My floors were super dirty. I am going to be using the Fabuloso, and I think that it's in the scent Springtime Fresh. Don't
Buffy was looking so sweet, all snuggled up in the wrap. I was trying to help Elvis out by getting this couch cushion out, but I wasn't able to do this, so I'm just going to be throwing everything in the washer, and him and I are going to be getting this couch done together. This couch was super gross and even Owen and Elvis had picked some stuff up and threw it in the trash but we are going to be getting it nice and clean you guys will see in the next clip Elvis decided to take over. So here is the mess that we had before we got everything put back together. Now we're going to get into the girls room which isn't terrible. Victoria has been doing a really good job keeping up on her room but I do need to get into the closet, declutter some of the clothing. I'm going to be putting some stuff away that I'm going to be saving for Sophia and then I have a few baskets of laundry over here that I need to get taken care of. be throwing everything into a hamper that way I can go through it. Camila's at that age where she loves to change her outfit multiple times a day so it is really hard to keep up on her um, dressers and keeping them organized but I'm just going to get everything quickly organized. It's not going to be perfect but I'm sure she's going to be in here within the next day or two just taking everything out. She loves to change into pajamas and then she loves to change her outfit. It's just always a mess y'all. Remember 
It is later in the evening. I had to take a break. I did get a lot of trash out of the girls' closet and I um, cleaned out their bins that I have like the little cube organizers in. But I am just going to get the girls' bed made and we're going to be doing some quick cleaning in here. And then y'all will see the next day we're going to do some more organizing.
I got this from Amazon to put some clips in and hair ties. I don't love it. It's okay. It was only like $8, so I guess it's not that bad of a buy. I just feel like it's cheaply made and pretty flimsy, but I did get two of these scrunchy things, and I thought that this was a really, really good buy for, I think I paid $10 for these, and I really like them. I also got this from Amazon for Camila and Sophia's bows. I really like it. I think it was like $15. If you guys want the link for any of these things, just let me know in the comments and I will either comment back to you or I'll add it into the description box. Now that we're finished with the girls' room, we are going to head into Owen's room.
But it's not that easy You're complicating things for me No, it's not that easy Maybe just a little time can heal me But it doesn't feel the way What are you doing to me? Why'd you break my heart? All right, so my room is pretty messy. We're going to get it picked up. And yes, I have already started buying Christmas pajamas. I just feel like if you don't buy them now, they're gonna go fast. And I did pick these ones up from Target and I'll be um, showing them to you guys. For the girls, I did get all of them, the red ones, but I didn't think Owen would like those. They were kind of girly. So for pictures, I got them all the matching white and green pajamas.
mentioned before that the baby had been spitting up and I need to now take these sheets off and get them in the wash too. But this is basically all the laundry. The kids had a few things in here, um, but that's pretty much all the laundry from the baby just spitting up. In and out of love, never get enough. We never seem to get older. When things are going right, you seem to have the time. But when it's hard, you just grow cold up. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. The words you be, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. Fires around ourselves. We should be good, but we keep out of fires. The words repeat, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep out of fires. Fires round ourselves. It's deja vu. Set up a stage of lights Say we're done, say it's over Shouldn't be coming back But somehow we connect Acting drunk even though we're so To clean the countertop and bathtub and shower I'm gonna be using this Clorox bleach gel Cause we're scared of the silence We should be good but we keep lighting fires Fires around ourselves We should be good but we keep lighting fires Alright guys, that is pretty much it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure to give it a like and if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button for more cleaning motivation. Thank you guys so much for being here today and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne. In today's video, we are going to be picking up my messy house. 
I don't have too much work that I need to get done, but it is a little bit messy. And first I am going to be putting up everything that I used to make lunch. Let me know in the comments what you guys are up to today. I did not plan on making this video. Honestly, I thought the last cleaning video I made was going to be the one before baby came, but I'm still currently pregnant and I really just needed to take my mind off of still being pregnant. So I decided I wanted to do something that was a little bit normal and I'm not sure why it felt normal to get out the camera and clean, but it really did. All my kids were at school. Camila does go to school two days a week and I'm rarely ever home alone um, unless I'm doing like cleaning videos. Elvis will take the kids out. Um, so I was feeling a little bit lonely and overwhelmed with the fact that I am still pregnant, y'all. So I figured I would just get the camera out and do some cleaning. And I'm currently editing this video right after I got done with it, just in case, um, you know, baby does come soon. But I hope you guys enjoy it. It is just um, a very basic cleaning video. I honestly just can't do too much because I'm, I'm not in a lot of pain, but I'm definitely in some pain. Um, so hopefully you guys like it. Give it a thumbs up if you do. And let me know how you guys are doing in the comments. Alright, so I got the kitchen picked up. It feels really nice to have that done. Now I'm going to get started on the dishes. I did have a lot of dishes that I needed to get done last night. I washed some things by hand and then as you guys can see, I already have dishes in the sink. Um, I think I had a few things left over from um, dinner last night and then I also had things from breakfast and then I made myself lunch. So I'm going to get all that taken care of. Everybody's singing oh, everybody's singing oh. I don't know what it is about you. It must be in the way you move. Just say you want me to. We got nothing to lose. You're looking so old. You're looking so old. Now I'm moving closer to you. And it's getting dark in this room Tell me what you wanna do Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love you, let me love you Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love, let me love Baby, let me love you Just say the word and we can leave this place Take you anywhere you want As long as we're together Everything will do You got me going all You got me going all Now I'm moving closer to you And it's getting dark in this room Tell me what you want to do So it has been a while since I gave the sink a really good clean. I always use, like to use the soft scrub with bleach I think it does the best job. I also picked up these sponges from Ikea. They were really inexpensive and I think they do a good job. I 
your eyes I don't know how but it feels like I'm drunk on you It's almost like you make me fly And when I look at you smile I don't know how but it feels like I'm drunk on you It feels like I'm drunk on you It feels like I'm drunk on you Using the Blue Land All Purpose Cleaner to clean the countertops. I will have a link for you guys in the description box below if you would like to check them out. I actually talked about them in my last video and I've really been loving their cleaning products. If you missed my fall clean and decorate, I'll make sure to have the link in the description box below. That way you can go check it out. But I just want to say thank you so much for everyone who has went over there, watched that video, and gave it lots of love. I appreciate you guys so much. You have no idea. Whenever you work really hard on a video and it does good, it always feels really nice. Surprisingly, the fall decor on the table hasn't really gotten messed up, so I am just going to leave it. We've actually been eating at the island a lot. Not a ton to do in the living room I am just gonna get the couch put back together and do a quick vacuum in here this rug and my couch both need a really good clean um, but I am going to do that after I have the baby Elvis told me that he would help me out especially with the couch I'm pretty sure somebody spilled some apple juice or something on here and then I think we're gonna need a new rug at some point this one is really old I think we've had it for probably like seven years so I think that even though I still love it I think that we're gonna probably need another one soon loving me was all you tried when you were around I've been told too many times now Yeah, loving me was all you tried when you were around I've been told too many times now But somewhere Myself. I have told you many times now 
I'm gonna get everybody's shoes picked up and then get all of the junk over here put away. This is kind of like a catch-all space here. It's always messy. Now I'm just quickly going to wipe the glass door down. Alright, so now we're going to head into the master bedroom, which as you guys can see, it's pretty messy in here. We're going to get everything picked up and then I'm going to just get the bed made, wipe down the side tables and do some vacuuming. He got me high above, like the sun by the moon, he's a star, baby, I'm light enough, like a fool, it's true, it's true. He's making me blow my mind and I can't stand without a being without us I'm being honest, y'all, I'm being honest We just do what we do, ain't no joke about love He's the one that I die for Can't long side by side, I can't believe that he is mine We just do what we do And please ignore how swollen my feet and legs are a few days they're good and then I'll go a couple days and they'll be super swollen and that's one thing that I am so looking forward to is not having swollen legs or feet. It has been um, pretty bad this pregnancy. I don't remember it being this bad, my other three pregnancies. Um, so that is probably almost one of the number one things that I am just ready not to deal with. Wiped in the furniture, I am just using a disinfectant wipe. I'm being honest, y'all. He's making me jump from high ground. Keeps catching me every time I fall. He got me safe inside.
to get it right Trying to find some balance in my life But I never really put up a fight Didn't follow my dreams decided that I think the bassinet will be better on the other side um, because it is kind of blocking the way into the bathroom and y'all know when you're a mom you're getting up multiple times a night probably still going to the bathroom and all of that so I don't want to be knocking into the baby bed so I just went ahead and moved that over to the other side now we're gonna come in here to the bathroom we're gonna get everything picked up wiped down it's not gonna be a perfect clean in here. It's really hard for me to bend down and like clean the shower and things like that, but I'm gonna do my best in here. that is pretty much it for today i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to give it a like and if you haven't already hit that subscribe button for more cleaning motivation thank you so much for being here today and i will see you in the next one bye
something about the way you make me feel inside I'm counting down the days till we fly away Heading to the sun, only you and me are Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne and today we have some Saturday cleaning motivation. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like. It really helps out my channel and I appreciate you all stopping by to clean with me or if you're having a cup of coffee and you're just relaxing, I hope you guys enjoy that and if it brings you some motivation, let me know in the comments. First, we're gonna start out in the living room and you guys can see it's actually raining. If you don't know, we live in Arizona, so we love when we get some rain and I thought it was the perfect day to get some cleaning done. If you guys missed the video where I added in the new rug and TV stand, I'll link it in the description box below. But I did get a few questions about where the rug was from. I've actually linked it in the description box also. But I wanted to let you all know it sheds really bad. I vacuum every other day and as you guys could see, it picked up a ton of stuff just vacuuming this small area. I've got something on my mind. I bet you know what I'm thinking about. You know I can't stop loving you Every time when you're looking at me It feels like my heart is keeping on beat, yeah You know I can't live without you You make me crazy In a good way So come on, baby Let's talk Let's talk about love Like you and me all night And let's talk about love Take you out tonight, kiss you in the moonlight. There is no place I'd rather be. Come on, girl, we can take my car, drinking some beers in your favorite bar. Yeah, you know I can't live without you. You'll make me crazy in that good way. So come on, baby, let's talk. Let's talk about love.
Let me know in the comments if you guys are getting excited for Christmas. I know that I am definitely getting excited. I actually purchased a few things from Target, but if y'all missed my Christmas decorating marathon from my videos of last year, I'll link that in the description box below if you wanna check it out for some inspiration. clean the countertops I am just using an all-purpose cleaner I have tons of dishes I need to get done today. I'm going to put away the clean ones, then we'll get started on the dirty ones. And my sink is super gross today, so I am gonna be using the soft scrub with bleach, which I think is the only thing that will get the stains out of my sink. All the things you said. Like I said, the sink is super dirty. We're gonna scrub it down with the soft scrub and then I'm gonna let it sit for a little bit and we'll rinse it out. And I find that's the best way to do it. Like a cargo, you will carry me. I just hope you 
emotions Sound is on the lighting Don't wanna pick a fight with The sun started to come out for a little bit, but we got so much rain. And like I said, here in Arizona, we love when we get rain. But about two weeks ago, I did get caught out on the highway in a sandstorm. And that is one thing that I do not like. I do not like sandstorms and I definitely don't like to be out in them. I was one of the first cars to pull over. Once it was um, clear and I could get up a little bit, I got about a quarter way up the highway and there was three racks. I ended up having to pull over again for about 25 minutes you could not even see in front of you it was just crazy we are actually from california but we've been out here for about i think eight years yeah we've been out here for eight years and that was the first sandstorm that i got caught in on the highway and it was pretty scary I got these little chore charts from Amazon a few weeks ago. I've been doing them for the kids um, just so they can mark off the things that they do throughout the day. And it's not even really chores, it's more like getting up in the morning, brushing your teeth, doing things like that. And I do have a few chores on them, but we were having some rough mornings. So I thought maybe if they could mark off what they were doing and know that they would get a reward at the end of the week, that maybe it would be better. I have to say that it has been better and that they have enjoyed knowing that they get to mark their things off in the morning once they complete them. Say you love me. Say you don't. Just give me something so I can move on. Pull me closer or push me away. Let me know if we'll be okay. Cause I can't stand another moment of you playing with my mind. I'm so tired and never knowing to so spell it out. Cause I won't stay awake till morning. I won't stay. So here are the chore charts. I do like to add some fun things on there like soccer for Owen and tumbling for Victoria. And then for the weekly chores, I will sit down and talk to them and ask them what they would like to do, which is like helping me with the dishes, vacuum, simple things that they're able to do. I always forget to wipe down the dishwasher whenever I'm wiping down all the stainless steel appliances. Today, I knew that it absolutely had to get done.
It is the next day and we are going to get the bathroom cleaned up. I'm going to start out by wiping down the mirror. I am using the Blue Land Cleaner with a microfiber cloth towel. so crazy from a simple maybe it was a long way down i just feel so heavy without you everything we were was just so pretty pretty enough to almost make me blind still denying everything you told me i'll repeat it in my mind all our memories goes on and on flashing up In the shower, I am using the Clorox bleach gel, and then I also picked up this scrubber from Target. I do like to keep some diapers, wipes, extra outfits, and some bath stuff in here for Sophia. It just makes it easier to find when I'm rushing. Somehow I'm missing a pillowcase, so we're just going to be putting three pillows on the bed for today. Let's talk. Meet me at the avenue.
So I'm going to finish up here with vacuuming and then we're going to head into Victoria's room which isn't too bad. She's been doing a really good job of keeping up on cleaning her room and here is Camila. She was looking through the books and I thought it was so cute. She was sitting on this massive Squishmallow that Victoria loves all of the Squishmallows. Actually all of my kids have been getting into the Squishmallows. So I made some plans, some dreams to catch, to promise lands, to find my path. that's it for today i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to give it a like and hit that subscribe button for more cleaning motivation i appreciate you guys so much for watching today's video and i will see you guys in the next one bye
Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne and today's video is going to be a Saturday clean with me. I'm also going to have a Christmas decor haul. I hope you enjoyed today's video and if you do, make sure to give it a like. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button for more cleaning motivation and some holiday decor inspiration that will be coming up really soon. First, we are going to be starting out in the kitchen. I hope you all are having a wonderful day and make sure to say hi in the comments. I got the clean dishes put away and then I had a lot of dirty dishes I had to do but my camera ran out of memory so now I'm going to be cleaning out the sink. I'm going to be using the soft scrub with bleach. I'm going to let it sit in there for a little bit and then I'm going to give it a double scrub since it was so dirty today. I want to say thank you so much to everyone for helping me reach 30,000 subscribers. I am so appreciative of each and every one of you. I get so many comments about how I help motivate you guys, but in return, you all have no idea how much you help motivate me. There are some days that honestly, I do not feel like getting up and getting this cleaning done. It has been a struggle especially with like the last few weeks it has been hard to get things done around here and i've been feeling overwhelmed but all of your sweet messages y'all have no idea how much they mean to me and i just want to say thank you guys so much Soap top wasn't terrible today, so I am just going to give it a quick wipe down. I got this candle from Target and I thought it was cute. It smells like gingerbreads and you guys know that I love the scent gingerbread. It is definitely one of my favorite scents.
The seats were pretty dirty, so I am going to wipe them down. I am just using some dish soap with a microfiber cloth towel. Let me know in the comments, how has the weather been where you guys are at? Are you guys having some real fall weather? Here in Arizona, it's been okay. We've been in like the high 70s, so I guess that's fall for us. The living room isn't awful today, but Camila had been drawing on all the post-it notes, so I am going to get that picked up and get the couch put back together. Before I mop, I am going to wipe down the windows. I noticed that they were super dirty, so I am just using this cloth that you put some water on. I think it's called the Ultimate Cloth, and I'm going to quickly wipe them down. Stuck in my head 
I'm so excited to share with you guys what I've picked up for Christmas so far. Let me know in the comments if you guys have already been shopping for Christmas decor and what theme you're going with. This year I'm going to go with a gingerbread candy cane theme. I'm still going to keep the whites and reds in my house. I'm just adding some uh, gingerbread to it. So that pillow I picked up from Target. It is sold out online right now. And then I picked up these pillowcases from Amazon. I thought they were going to be more of a true red color, but I think that they'll still look good. I picked up this little tree from Walmart and then this other one I picked up from at home and it lights up. I got this little tree from Home Goods and I thought it was really cute and it matches the gingerbread house that I'm going to be showing you guys. I thought that was just so cute and I had to have them when I saw them. As you guys can see, I'm getting a lot of little trees. I also picked up that little sweater tree from Target and then these two gingerbread houses I got from Walmart and I thought they were a pretty good buy. Um, they're a little bit more expensive but I guess with inflation everything is going up. And then Camila helped me pick out some ornaments for the girls room and we're going to be also doing a gingerbread theme in there but all this stuff I picked up from at home and it is more of like a pastel gingerbread and I thought it was so pretty. I thought that these ornaments from at home were so adorable. I love the little Mrs. Claus and then there's another gingerbread one in there. Oh, I just think they're so cute. And these next few trees that I'm going to be showing you are from Target. And y'all, anything that has like a cute little Santa face or a Mrs. Claus face, I cannot pass it up. This next tree I'm going to be showing you guys from Target, like I said, and it's so cute, the little Santa Claus. Right now I'm standing in the corner I see you from across the room It's kind of crowded here, but I know you see me too Everybody's singing, oh Everybody's singing oh. So I do have an idea for all these trees. I want to do like a tablescape with them. I don't know how it's going to turn out. I'm hoping that I like it. Um, but if not, hopefully I'm sure I can find somewhere to put all of these trees at. I'm sure I can put them like on the TV stand and in the kitchen and find just random places to put them. Now I'm moving closer to you and it's getting dark in this room. And I did just want to give you all a quick overview of all of the things that I got so far. In the last few days, I did pick up a couple more things. I don't know if I'll use absolutely everything that I got. Some things I will probably try out. I may not like them and want to take them back. 
um, but when I do my Christmas clean and decorate, I will be showing you guys that process and letting you guys know what I plan on keeping and what I plan on taking back. But honestly, I'm the worst person at taking things back to the store and returning them. So we'll see. Maybe I'll just love everything that I got. It is later in the day and now we're going to quickly clean the master bathroom. Now I'm moving closer to you and it's getting dark in this room. Tell me what you want to do. Baby, let me love you. I don't know how, but it feels like I'm drunk on you. It's almost like you make me fly. And when I look at you smile, I don't know how, but it feels like I'm drunk on you. It feels like I'm drunk on you. It feels like I'm drunk on you. In the bathtub and the shower, I have been using the Clorox bleach gel and then I've been using this um, scrub brush that I got from Target. So I'm quickly finishing up the bathroom. I heard Sophia starting to wake up. She was over in the little bassinet uh, sleeping and while I was doing the bathroom, I could kind of hear her moving around and then she fully woke up. So I needed to get her taken care of and then we will finish up the master bedroom.
I'm not sure if anyone else is feeling this way. I feel like we're just about ready to get into that really busy season of life. I feel like right around the holidays, around Halloween, all the way up until Christmas is just so busy and I've already been feeling so overwhelmed lately. I know that it's just a lot, you know, being two months postpartum, but if you're feeling overwhelmed, I just want you to know that you're not alone and that I hope you all find motivation and some kind of comfort out of my videos. I was actually watching something earlier on Instagram about unrealistic um, expectations of being postpartum and that is never um, how I want to make people feel when they come to my channel. I want you guys to feel motivated and um, inspired to get up and do what you can do, what feels right to you. I know that lately, you know, I have been struggling. Um, I don't always like to talk about my personal life on social media, you know, out of fear of being judged and things like that. But I do want to let you guys know that if you're feeling overwhelmed, if you're a new mom or you are a seasoned mom and you are struggling to keep up with your house, just know that it is completely normal and there are tons of women out there that are feeling just the same way as you and I'm just sending lots of love to everyone. Riding on the dizzying heights All right, so the last thing we're gonna be doing in here is finishing up vacuuming, and Camila's over there. She's so cute reading her book. Um, but that is pretty much it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure to give it a like, hit the subscribe button for more cleaning motivation. Thank you guys so much for being here today. I really do appreciate it, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. I'm running, running, running out of patience There's gotta be somebody who can save me Gotta be someone who feels the same